Hi, I'm here out at C.B. Smith, and as you can see, the beautiful trees. I've been out here before, and I've showed you guys how beautiful it is. You can see the greenery and the trees behind me as I'm walking. The reason for this today, well, one fold, I wanted to be able to breathe and get that beautiful prana that the oxygen has. It's the difference between oxygen and the light that sustains you. And it is within that oxygen. But the real reason that I put this up today, and I was here to get that, is um, I was walking along and I realized the inspiration was given to me. I had a couple of people today talk about that they're not happy they're living. And sometimes they just want for it to all finish and go away. And so I'm putting out there to anyone that is not celebrating their life, very depressed, that hang on, hang on, take a look at your beauty. Get out of nature, hold on to hope and faith and love. Love is a healer. Start embracing yourself. Start embracing nature. Whatever is going on in your life, it doesn't matter what it is. Those are experiences and this too will pass. I remember my sister used to have this poster and it really truly meant a lot to me. And it was a set of people going on a roller coaster and on the bottom it said, and this too shall pass. There's nothing in this world that is hard enough or bad enough or painful enough for you to take this beautiful life, this beautiful body that has been given to you, this beautiful opportunity, and just throw it away. Have the faith that at any given moment, just outside this moment, this second, things could change. I remember years ago when I came out of a battered situation, I wanted to end it. It came to the point where I finally ended it because I figured I chose me, but I didn't want to be here either. And I realized internally how much I hated myself. Start loving yourself enough that you love yourself more than those experiences that are negative, that you view as negative, that are teaching tools for you. I would have never in a million years think or thought that I could be in this place of just pure love, celebration and ecstasy, and understanding the light and the beauty that we are. And understanding that the light and beauty that resonates through everything and everybody that sustains us is love and you connect with that and that will help you to get through anything anything in this world so i'm going to continue my beautiful walk i'm going to try here so you can see a little bit more you can see the clouds maybe i could turn it i don't know if you could see the sun, I don't know if you got the sun there. Trying to see if I could get the sun so you guys could see it. I don't think that's gonna happen. So I tried so that you could see how beautiful the sun is. And the sun, just like the stars, symbolizing the light that you have within you. Sometimes it's cloudy. I almost didn't come today because it was a little bit cloudy. But the clouds kind of 
overcome the the light but just the light is still shining there the sun is always there just like the stars are always there in the night the light within you is always there just waiting just waiting for you to get in touch it with it and again I can't say it enough once you're in touch with who you truly are which is your heart that watches your thoughts you could overcome anything the false self would have you believe that everything is falling apart in your life and it's not these are just experiences to help the false self break down and help the soul expand like I have mentioned on Sunday when I put up that video so please search in your heart anybody that's contemplating ending their life or can't even phantom speaking to another person get yourself a sounding board somebody that you know I like to say that statement that will take your ghost in the closet with them anywhere they go and that you could trust and speak to them because when you speak or you write it out it's helping you to eliminate it stay with those feelings your feelings and really feel where the depression or sadness is coming from get in touch with it it always goes back to some kind of trauma that we've buried under a rug so lift that rug and start taking them out I'm gonna go continue my walk here's some a beautiful lake just giving you some scenery for anybody out there just to help you guys out and like always from my heart to yours I love all of you and understand today is a blessed day every moment is a blessed day celebrate smile even if you don't feel like it it'll help you put on a funny movie that helps and um, I mentioned on Sunday you could do a mala to help those negative thoughts move into a move away and get trashed and get some new beautiful thoughts coming in well love you all have a beautiful beautiful day enjoy remember we always share that love and light bye